Hey, what's up you guys? Marty Schwartz here with GuitarJams.com. Gonna teach you a pretty easy beginner acoustic song. It's all the open beginner chords that I, you know, teach students first. And if you want a diagram of all those chords, I actually have an ebook that I give out off the link below this box. Um, anyway, let's, uh, let's go right to the lesson just real quick. I've got a capo on the third fret and I always see comments. What if I don't have a capo? Um, you could literally take uh, shoestrings and tie it really tight around that third fret or use some kind of uh, stick or pen and tie it down. Uh, although I would really recommend you just going and buying a capo. But uh, anyway, here we go to the lesson. All right, so we've got the capo on the third fret and then we're gonna start with what's called a C major chord. Okay, and check out this rhythm. So we got down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Real slow, real straight. Down, down, up, up, down, up. And it's, it might even be a little slower than that. It's definitely a slow paced song. So we start with that C. Then we want to take that middle finger and move it to the second fret of the A string. And if you can pluck it, followed by that strumming even better. Next, we're going to move that middle finger back over and our ring finger on the second fret up from the cable on the G string. So these two there, that's still there. So, so far we have the rhythm pattern on C, the lock down note, and then the A minor chord. And that's going to be followed by an F chord, which what we want to do is take our ring finger off and move it up to the third fret of the D, and the middle finger scoots over and goes to the second fret of the G. That's an F chord. Now you can get a little thicker sound if you have your ring finger there and your pinky underneath there. It's, you know, more strings to strum, basically. But that'll do. Okay, so we have... Next uh, chord, middle finger can stay on the same note, second fret of the G, ring finger or pinky on the third fret of the B, index on the first fret of the high E, and that's a D minor chord. Same rhythm. And then that rhythm pattern on a G chord, I play, you know, when I have a lot of C chords, I may play the G with these fingers as opposed to these fingers, but that's the next chord. Followed by a C chord. Then it starts over. So you actually have that rhythm pattern for two times on the C major chord at the end there with a little bit of an embellishing. And this is you know, this is a trick you can do with a lot of chords, but you can take, you know, basically take where your middle finger is of the chord and strum the chord and then hammer that note down. And that adds a nice little quality to it. All right, let's play the whole thing except for the refrain at the end. So we've got C. Walk down note. A minor. F. D minor. To G. To 
C. It's a little embellishing. Starts over. So we're going to go same thing, but just the D minor to G back and forth three times. Third time. Followed by this little thing uh, three times, which is just the C walk down to A minor, but it happens quicker. You don't play it faster, it's just, it, it uh, you don't strum it for as long, so it's like. moves that we were doing before but he's doing a lot of oohs and ahs right here I think and then just the very end is F D minor C you do F that way you do that way you could actually do a bar chord. And these are all chords that fit in one key. And you know, with the we've shifted it up, but basically all these chords fit in what's called the key of C major. C, D minor, E minor, F, G, and A minor. So the one chord, the two chord, the three chord the four chord, the five chord, the six chord. And there is a seven chord, but we're not dealing with that. So anyway, hope you had fun with that. All right, that was the lesson. I uh, hope you had fun learning uh, maybe a new song. It's a real sweet, pretty uh, little song. So anyway, remember I have that free ebook and some other cool stuff. You just click the link below this uh, video Tron box. And we'll see you in another lesson real soon. Take care.